from England to France and back again, then back again and back again. Sarah Thomas swam the channel four times in a row, no stops, no sleep, and fueled only by protein drinks with caffeine. Covered in protective grease, she stumbled and crawled onto the beach after 54 hours in the channel. A glass of champagne may be not tasting so good after all that salt water. My mouth. Yeah. Yeah, your lips are pretty swollen. Well done. Yes, my well done, Sarah. The shortest swimming distance across the channel is 21 miles, so if she'd been lucky, Sarah's total would have been 84. But as her tracked route shows, the wind, tides and currents made it more complicated and meant she swam for around 130 miles. She pushed the boundaries of endurance swimming way, way, way beyond the normal limits. Uh, it, in fact, it couldn't really have been a physical thing because uh, it, it, it's impossible to, to do that. It must have been a, a sheer act of will. That willpower meant Sarah, an experienced endurance swimmer back home in America, went straight from breast cancer treatment last year into full training for her epic channel swim. It was really important to have a goal and dreams that existed beyond cancer so that cancer didn't define me. I had to get through it. I didn't have a choice. I had to be ready. Sarah dedicated her channel swim to all the survivors out there and then went back to her hotel for a well-earned sleep. Well done, Sarah. Peter Lane, 5 News.